guys, welcome to Get Real Bass Fishing. Today, I'm out on the water with the guy that's walking away from the intro. This is Brian Fisker Outdoor Adventures on YouTube. I'll link him down below, but he's been here all morning. He's caught some bluefish, and uh, I kind of slept in because I spent the night editing and spent some time with the baby this morning. Good stuff, but we're gonna try to catch some fish. You've had fish already. Had a couple, had a couple. It's not, it's not been, uh fierce and ferocious like we're used to uh, in the spring, but it is early and the water is literally freezing. It's like I can't feel my toes, it's so cold. Yeah, I mean, you, you gotta remember, it's still really, really early. Although the, like the bays and everything are warming up, there's still spots that are freezing cold this and it's still early. It's, this is not heating up, but. And it's kind of dirty. Well, we had that big blow the other day. This water was all the way up, but. All right, let's go try to catch some fish and see what we can salvage out of today. Let's go. Release. That's <laughs> the way to unhook them. Man. Yeah. Fire the way. Required. That reminds me of me when I'm trying to get out of my chair in the morning. <laughs> That's all right. of the year for me and he's a turn he's an absolute unit all right Bloody. go my first bluefish of the year came on a six inch mag darter dude he's been through a lot look at those scars Dang. look at it like it's seen way better days obviously he was hungry <laughs> Finally got my bluefish for the year. Hopefully there's more coming in. Let's go. See the mouth on that one? It jumped. Oh my gosh! Oh, he's gone. He's gone. Like a salmon. <coughs> I screamed my voice. Yeah. When he popped out, the first hook popped out of his face, and he was only hooked on 
one of the one of the uh, points on the back trouble. Jeez. Oh gosh. This is 20 pound test. I'm gonna have to walk this one. <laughs> Actually, this one might be 15. Hit the shutter button, like you're taking a picture. And then that red circle, yep. All right, here we go. Oh, it's a striper. Really? Yeah. Nice. It's a striper. Oh, something we can tag. Seven foot? I thought I was going to hook into a bluefish or something, but look at that. Check that out. Right on the spin. Yeah, little it's got lice all over them. But nice little bucktail bass with a five inch smooch and release grub. Let's tag it. Let's tag it. All right, put the camera down. Let's tag this boy. Here we go. 23 inch bass tagged for GFR. Let's get a photo for the website. Get down low. Thanks. And I looked in the picture, I looked like a door. Did not expect a striper, but the old spikes bucktail with the grub did the trick. Mwah. Let's do a release. I've tried a couple different bucktails today. I had the one and a half ounce on the big one, on the big rod. I had a one, at, one ounce on the big rod. I tried a three quarter on the big rod and they all seemed like they were going down on the bottom catching weeds and everything. So I switched over to a half ounce because I had my bucktail box and had all the options, of course. But uh, threw it on the seven foot, 20 pound test, 15 pound breed. And this is a siege rated to uh, 5 8 to 2 ounce, so it felt really, really nice. I really didn't expect a, a striper, but hey, it worked. Just floating it down. Let's get more. All right, so me and Brian went over to a little spot and uh, I hooked into, we didn't even take the cameras, we were just like, oh, let's chill here for a while. But I hooked into a 25 inch striped bass. So we're tagging him. All right, ready? Yeah. Come on. There we go. Nice. All right, let's get a photo with the tag. There we go. Mwah, smooch and release. We were fishing all, all morning and we caught some stripers and blues 
now we're at a new location and we're gonna try catching some stripers and blues here but on a sunset and nighttime bite hopefully we get something we're supposed to be meeting uh, mr. Joe bags himself out here as well so hopefully we can get him on some fish and uh, have a great night either way just being out fishing it's fun let's go Best chicken sandwiches you could possibly get. I love putting on sink here. You get a picture of me with the bass, with a swatter, with the guy that makes it. That's a very nice bass, dude. I love that rod. Nice. Well, I don't know how big this is, but I'm gonna say that might be legit. Yeah, that's uh, that's definitely 23 a maybe. Probably 23. I was gonna say 22, 23. 22, 23 inch fluke. Nice little freedom shad. Nice. Since I'm here on a tour, and I don't think anybody else wants any fluke tonight, we're gonna show you the proper release of a quality fluke. Give you guys an opportunity to get back at them, let this fish grow, and maybe you'll catch them later. Oh, he destroyed the freedom shad pretty good, like a bluefish. Come on, buddy, open up. There we go. Dang, he's just blending how, in. Like, you see how he just blends right in with his yeah. fins? He did that little wave. See how he just covers up? I love that look. And then they just ambush anything that comes near them. That's awesome. Love that. Alrighty guys, thank you for watching. I appreciate all the support you guys have been showing me. All the new subscribers, thank you for hitting that red subscribe button. If you haven't already, what are you doing? Hit that red subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up if you want to see more content from us because that's how the algorithm works. You hit that thumbs up, you're going to see our future content. Or content from the past that you haven't seen. Anyway guys, we had fun out on the water. We caught bluefish, stripers, and fluke all in one day. And uh, I'm really happy to see that, that there's a lot of fish in the water already. So I'm sure we're gonna be catching a lot more in the future. If you guys wanna help support the channel, best thing you can do is hit that red subscribe button if you haven't already, hit that thumbs up button. That way you see all the future content. And you can go to smoochrelease.com slash shop, pick up some sweatshirts. They run a little small, so get a size a little bit bigger. We've got some hats, and of course, we have this entire wall of stuff that you can buy. Bucktail, silicone jigs for the fluke, and a bunch of different grub presentations. Spinners, stuff like that. Go check it out on the website, smoochrelease.com slash shop. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Stay real, smooch and release, and have some fun on the water. We'll see you next time.